In this video, I'm going to show you step-by-step -step how to install Comfy UI. Comfy UI is the most powerful user interface for Stable Diffusion, as it allows you to mix and match custom nodes to get custom and extremely powerful workflows. You can import custom workflows by simply dragging and dropping an image or a JSON file. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download the Python code to run the software, also going to install Git so you can manage the software. We are going to download the software itself in addition to the Comfy UI Manager within Comfy UI to unlock its full potential. Now, with that out of the way, let's jump right in. First off, let's create the folder to extract the files to. So just new folder, then just name it something like Comfy UI. I'm going to name mine Comfy UI Tutorial for obvious reasons. If this is your first time installing something from GitHub or even running an application that uses Python, we are going to need to install both Git and Python. So this is Git. The link is down in description. Git will allow you to use functions within command prompt to install repositories from GitHub as well as update them. The next thing is Python. It is the coding language that Comfy UI is programmed in as well as all the extensions. So you're definitely going to need this if you don't already have it. A good majority of you will be coming from Automatic 11.11. So you will already have this installed if that's the case. So just scroll down, click on the installer that you need. Then as you are installing, make sure you add Python to the path by checking this box here. It's very important. So now that we have everything installed to run and manage Comfy UI, let's install it. So in the GitHub, just scroll down to installing and just click this right here, direct link to download. Now, if you have 7-zip, the file icon will look like this. If you have WinRAR, the file icon will look something like this. So double click into that file, extract, then go to the folder that we have created and click OK. Cool, now everything should be installed correctly. So if you are an automatic 1111 user currently and have a ton of different models and stuff that you want to transfer over to Comfy UI, you can do that without having to re-download everything. I'll show you that right now. Just go into the Comfy UI folder, then click on this extra model paths.yaml file. Then you can just open this up in Notepad or VS Code, but to keep it simple, I'll go Notepad. So it is as easy as changing this base path to the path where your automatic 11.11 folder is. So how you do that, just navigate to where your Stable Diffusion Web UI folder is, double click into it, and then copy this path here. And then just replace this, and that's it. Just make sure you save it. And now lastly, make sure you rename this file. And you wanna keep everything exactly the same except for getting rid of this dot example. So just do that, hit enter, and then yes. And it should read as a .yaml file. And now going up one directory, you should see a run CPU batch file and a run NVIDIA GPU batch file. If you have a NVIDIA GPU, pretty self-explanatory. If you want to launch Comfy UI, use this one here. And you want to run on your CPU, you can use this one here. So just double click. Cool. And before I go, I'm going to quickly show you how to install the Comfy UI Manager. So to do that, navigate to the Comfy UI folder, go to custom nodes, then go to the search bar, type in CMD. So now that we have opened the command prompt with this location as our directory, we're going to do git clone and then paste this comfy UI URL into here. Link is in the description. Then just enter. Once that is finished installing, now just restart your comfy UI. Let's close it out, reboot it. Now you can see that we have this new manager button here. Now we have the manager. This is going to be necessary for using comfy UI to its utmost capabilities. And I have a ton of tutorials to share with you down the road. All right, and that is how you install comfy UI. I hope it made sense. I hope you were able to install it without a hitch. If for whatever reason you're having any issues, make sure you join the Tyrant Empire to get access to our free private Discord community. I can help you out there. So with that said, my friend, that is the end of this video. I'm going to go to sleep. Till next time, I'm out.